Yo guys, what is up? And in today's video, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to add any font that you want in DaVinci Resolve Studio or DaVinci Resolve Regular. Now, actually, this is going to be such a short tutorial because it is actually so simple. I'm going to show you guys how to do this right now. So let's say you're in two positions. You either one, have a font that you want to download or two, you want to just look for fonts to use in DaVinci Resolve. So there's two ways we're going to do this. We're going to do if you have a font name already. So let's just say you want SF Pro font free download. That's all you're going to look up. And if you see here, you're going to have a lot of people advertising that you can download it for free. So right here on font download, you know, it's a real legit site. We're going to click this SF pro font free. So now we're in here in the website. You have to make sure you're not going to get scammed. So if we go download font for free, it instantly downloaded it. Now this is an easy website. This is a lot easier, but guys do not get scammed by websites out here that take you to a download page that is not there. So anyways, with your SF Pro font, you're going to have a zip file. You're just going to double click this zip file and you're going to drop down and have all these different things that you can download, right? Now you can go through and hit space bar and see which font that you want looks like, or if you just quite frankly want all of them, you could just go ahead and install all of them. But what we're going to do is we're just going to double click on this. And since I already have it installed, you will have a big install button right here instead of replace. Then once you open DaVinci Resolve, you head over to titles and grab a text plus in the timeline. And if we go over to titles and name this SF Pro, we can go to the font and just search SF in our keyboard and SF Pro display will toggle on. And as you can see, I downloaded all of them. So we're just going to go black italic, turn that bad boy all the way up. You know, say we want to name the day of our our title for our video. So, you know, something we could do here is just go to the red outline, turn this on, crank that thickness up, and then just change this to a simple black. And you know, you're already one step closer to having good texts that you want. Now version two, we're going to go to duh font Com. I will leave this this website in the description. So Duff Font is a very sketchy looking because it's just such an old school website, but to browse, all you have to do is just literally just go through these fonts, like view all fonts, or if you have a category that you want, you could do that as well. But if you can't find a download for any font that you want, so say you want to search up SF Pro, you could do that here. You could search it. Now in Defont specifically, SF Pro is not a thing, but say you want to look up something that you do have, you can always type it in this search bar. So let's just say I want something that is square. It's going to give me a bunch of square titles. Let's just say I like this one right here. All I'm going to do is just hit this download button and it's just going to install right into my files and I'm just going to open this zip file, open this up and just hit the big blue install button. Now, if we head back into DaVinci Resolve, we can go under the font and just search that text. And you will basically have any title that you want. Just don't forget, if you don't see your font in DaVinci Resolve, just restart the software and it should be in there. If you guys enjoyed this and if it was helpful, then make sure you drop a like and subscribe down below. It really helps my channel out. Go check out my editing packs that will literally save you hours of time editing. That's going to be it for today's video, guys. I hope you have a good day and peace out.